Hey, it's Holly. I am in Loveland, Colorado, right by Lake Loveland here. Happy Valentine's Day. It is our self-proclaimed holiday, and uh, we've uh, self-proclaimed it basically in 1946. Uh, that's when the postmaster, Elmer Ivers, and then also the president of the Chamber of Commerce at the time, Ted Thompson, and his wife, Mabel, decided to uh, have a Valentine remailing program. So now, oh, I think last I... I checked and it could be more about 200,000 Valentine's from all over the world get mailed here stamped with a cute little stamp like this one and then mailed to wherever your Valentine may be which is kind of cool now uh, it continued to grow in 1962 uh, Loveland had its first Miss Valentine Miss Loveland Valentine uh, I actually grew up here I wanted to be Miss Loveland Valentine but I went to school in another little tiny town still in the district but I didn't qualify for Miss Loveland Valentine which I always wanted. Maybe one day I'll be honorary. Hopefully. It goes to a high school senior who's really, you know, top of her class, teachers like her, kids like her. One has been chosen every year since 1962, and she goes to the Colorado State Legislature, meets the governor, does all, you know, opens grocery stores, things like that. I don't know if she does that, but yeah, we haven't had a grocery store open here for a while, but she might. Uh, if that happens in the future. And then since 1964, a couple years after that, uh, we have created our own Valentine uh, to help offset the cost of this fancy program that we are known for here. And uh, those are still around today, which is kind of fun. So there's a little background on uh, our, like I said, our self-proclaimed holiday, Valentine's Day from Loveland, Colorado, in the snow, in it pretty, on the lake. We're known for this lake. It's a nice walking trail when the weather's nice out. So a lot of fun. Enjoy your holiday. Enjoy being with your Valentine, and I'll talk to you later. Bye.